all signs seem to be pointing to the New York Giants wanting to embark on the Kelsey model this year, meaning making heavier use of the tight end position in 12 and 22 personnel. And while the Giants are, at least on paper, and assuming there are no injuries, set at the first two spots on the depth chart at tight end, there is a battle brewing for the third tight end spot on the roster. Right in the mix for that spot is Lawrence Cager, a converted wide receiver who last year flashed enough to warrant an invitation to this summer's training camp. Cager caught 18 passes for the Giants, but his blocking left a lot to be desired. The problem wasn't so much the ability to move his feet and gain position as a blocker. It was more of a lack of ideal strength and intensity in finishing his blocks. That all said, whether Cager makes the roster will all depend on what the Giants want out of their third tight end. Ideally, they'd like a guy who can contribute both in the passing game as well as the blocking game when called upon. But if they can't find that amongst the guys they have lined up to battle for that third spot, will the coaches favor more of a blocker such as Tommy Sweeney or a pass catcher such as Lawrence Cager? Training camp will sort all that out, as we also need to see how well the offensive line comes along with its blocking prowess. But suffice it to say, the competition for the third tight end spot is going to be one of those under-the-radar training camp battles that could offer a big clue into what the coaches might be planning for the offense this year.